Provided by former contractor turned whistleblower Edward Snowden, the U.S. National Security Agency is developing a powerful decoding program that could crack even the strongest of encryption codes. They've kept them um, classified largely, that they have lobbied to collect information about Americans, despite what they say about um, U.S. citizen information going into the data center, there are very real concerns that have been unalleviated about what information they're collecting about us. The program is being developed so it could decipher complex formulas used to protect other countries' codes. This is kind of an unprecedented um, construction project for the NSA really for the sole purpose of collecting information. The Washington Post says that the NSA is trying to develop a so-called quantum computer that would crack encryption codes used to hide sensitive information. The supercomputer could also be used in the health industry. It would cost about $80 million to develop and private businesses are also doing their own research and development. However, it's unclear if the government is ahead of private businesses in assembling such a large computer. Snowden's revelations have led to concerns over U.S. policies on data collection. But the whistleblower remains in trouble as U.S. officials look for ways to prosecute him. This is the most serious hemorrhaging of American secrets in the history of American espionage. Snowden leaked the information in 2013. Top U.S. officials, past and present, that have been involved in U.S. national security are fuming. He's revealing how we acquire this information. It will take years, if not decades, for us to return to the position that we had prior to his disclosure. This week, one of the U.S.'s more influential newspapers, the New York Times, encouraged clemency for Snowden because of the revelations he made from the NSA. So far, though, no influential officials have expressed support for a deal. Colin Campbell, Press TV, Washington.